What is up guys? I am in the Amazon jungle in Brazil with none other than Joe Flowers. And I have a tool burrito. I'm gonna hand it to Joe. And we are gonna fill this sucker with bushcraft deliciousness. Off. We're gonna get rid of every. I mean, there's some good stuff. In no, here chuck it. It's gotta go. It's gotta be empty. But I like go, the Joe. Tough sharpener. Fine. Get rid of it. So the goal here is to basically build a bushcraft kit from yeah. scratch, from all the people kicking around camp. All right, Joe. Let's do this, man. All right. Well, let's go see what kind of crazy stuff we can put in. What are we looking for in a bushcraft burrito? Okay, so bushcraft burrito stuff out here. We have a lot of bushcraft going on. As you can see, there's fire making. We have a lot of tool use too. So some tools that would be important for people. So that's one of the things that we're looking for. So I've got some wazoo things kind of mixed in with a box lighter here. Ooh, that is loud. And another whistle too. We got two whistles here. He likes it as well. But check this out. You know, you need some way to have an incendiary. So this is a small lighter that I found off of Amazon that catches up and it's really tiny and you can use kerosene or other types of fuel with it. So we have a lighter source, maybe even two that we have to put in here. All right, we have two whistles, redundancy, redundancy. Let's see what other people would pick. Huh? Okay. This is a fire starting device that the Matisse used. Mm -hmm. Made out of jungle stuff. Hey, and this is open. There's a little Allen wrench in there that somehow found its way in there. All right, so we have that, and it's able to breathe a little bit instead of getting all wet on the inside of this, which is kind of nice. And it's black, so you can dry it out really, really, really quickly. So we have some ridiculous sun over there. If we have to, we can put this right out there, and it'll dry really, really, really quick. It's kind of neat. <laughs> what else we got, Joe? All right, well, you know, we have to have, since we're out in the jungle, um, different means of carving tools. So let's go ask our uh, boat driver, Eber, what he's carrying. Eber, yo necesito un cuchillo. Tiene el Swiss Army knife or qué? Cuchillo para el cuchillo. Oh, well, he has a small fixed blade right here. This is a Mora Eldris. Um, this one's in stainless and he has it so he can find it really easily in the bush. The tool burrito has a very nice little spot for an Eldris or similar style knife. Oh, folds right in there. Look at that. Bam. That is quite the bushcrafting kit. And of course, you can use that to scrape the ferro rod that we have too. Um, yeah, let's go over and see what Peter has. Hey, Peter, we got some, we're looking to add bushcraft stuff to this. And it's not just to cover Ooh. all all places. Yeah. So like if you see a fire steel, you can still add a fire steel or something. But mm. what do you use a lot that you would put in here? Okay, so what do we got? Whistle? Mm -hmm. Ferro rod? Yeah. Knife. What's this? Fire starter. Fire starter? All right, what else do we think we need? Give, us, give us your best stuff, yeah, Peter. Your best What's stuff. That? Give Just us your, your best, best stuff. stuff. I, I want all the it things. Give me stuff that you use. That Joe is going out in the wilderness. He's going to die unless you save yeah, him. Yeah, unless I, unless I do a pocket dump. All right, I know one thing that's definitely missing that I use all the time. <gasps> Ooh, what, oh, do you, what do you use sharp. it for? All sorts of things. It's like the one device that's able to write on absolutely anything, taking notes. Sometimes you don't have your actual notebook and pen. You can jot yeah. down on your hand, or you just have this moment in between you and indigenous, and they say a word, you don't want to forget it. I'm packing a Sharpie. Ooh, he's, he's digging deep now, guys. All right. What else right. you got, Peter? Nemanja, you're up next with the pocket check on what you would add to this, even though it's, even if it's already there. So it can be a different knife or a different lighter or a different something. Is this bushcraft or survival? Yes. All of it. You know, we're that's gonna a very good question. All right, I'm we're gonna, gonna drop two Joe. Two items that people probably don't have right away. Toothpicks. Wow. I love these. Ha, even mint, mint flavored. Yeah, mint. All right, we're gonna add you these. You can use those as a fire starter. And because I'm an EMT and the medic, I want to make sure everybody has electrolytes. Oh, so that's what I'm adding down here. That is an EDC. Dude, you're going to be living well, Joe. I think so. Okay. Especially those are that. my contributions. Now we're talking. Thank you, Peter. You're welcome. We respect your contributions. <laughs> Nemanja. We yes. have. Good to see you. Thanks. I know. We're, uh, <laughs> yes, please. Here you go. Oh, cool. <laughs> that's good. And we're sending Joe out in the woods. Oh, finally. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Yes. And we're making a bushcraft burrito for him. Ah. What would you send him with? Hmm. 
Let's see. Yes. What do we, what do we have? It's a really here? good point. Amore Eldris, a Sharpie. Yeah, you can add to it too. If you see like other knives or what other, other add, writing yeah. things. Um, a headlamp. I don't have one on me, but I would give it a headlamp. Oh, it Obviously. needs a light. Would it fit though? It's got to fit. I, I don't know if it would roll in there. Headlamp's kind of big. Maybe a flashlight. Depending, depending on which type, but I think some will. If nothing else. Wait, wait a this second. Is, this is a flashlight. No. Yeah, Joe, you're cheating. Perfect. You can't oh, add your good. own things. Uh, now that has to be. <laughs> I will bring all of my things, but yeah, obviously. It just stays in my desk. <laughs> Let's pretend I pulled this. Oh, would you, would you look at that? Would you look at that? Um, which is uh, which light is this one that I own? Uh, th this one, <laughs> this one is the um, no, it's the through night, I think, uh, TI3, but uh, you can't really see anymore because it's been used a lot. Um, it's like a $25 knife, knife or a flashlight. flashlight. This is a flashlight, guys. Um, and it's like very easy to lose, but I won't be crying if I lose it. You know, when I have my hundred dollar one that I lost, that sucked. So, yeah. So that's, that's, ba that's, that's a really good one that, that you found in your pocket. Yes, and that's basically why I bought it. <laughs> anyway, so I would add this uh, to the kit. Now, one other thing I would add here would be a multi-tool, maybe a Victorinox uh, compact. Oof. Do you have one for him? I don't on me. All I have is a pineapple. Ever, can I un otro cochillo? No, you already went to Ever. You can't keep going back to the same well. That well's dry, Joe. I can give him and one other thing. Okay, he has a small, small fixed blade. I'll give him another fixed blade because this is basically the only thing I have on me right now. Apart from another small fixed blade. Dude, give him half a pineapple. That's where I draw the line. We said we were sending him out. All right, where are we headed, Joe? All right, what else do you need? We're going to go out and take a look around and see what else. How's that? How's that burrito folding? Is it is it thick? Yeah. Is it a let's take a look. fat burrito? It looks about the same width as it was when we first started. Nice. And I had all that cool stuff. I think because of the work sharp sharpener. Let's see, you have a kit here. Is there anything in there that you could add to this to help me, or help anybody? We're, going we're sending to the Amazon. We're sending Joe out into the woods. Yeah. What would you send him with, Nicola? And even uh, though even though things are covered, you'd be like, oh, you'll have a better time with this. Maybe a lighter. Ooh, ooh, better lighter. Yeah. Oh man, now I don't. Now I barely have to screw around with anything. No more, no more ferro uh, fuzz sticks. No more prep. I can just torch stuff. That's yeah, a heck of a lighter it's too. It's a torch. It's waterproof. Yeah, and it has a lock, so I can save stuff. Yeah, All right. Hmm. Oh, okay. Forge my own blade if I need yeah. to. Love it. All right, Joe, you got you got two minutes two to minutes. finish filling your burrito. Uh, let's keep going. Don't go to. Oh, he's hiding. I think. Hola, Eri. Hey, man. Can I <laughs> wake you up? Sorry about that. No, no. I like need that. help. I'm about to go to the jungle. <laughs> and uh, no photos, please. <laughs> he's, st he's still hiding. Um, uh, and I need... up, man. Ah, crap. Do you have anything in your pocket that you could put in here that would help me in the jungle? Hmm. Yeah. That's the thing. Well, for me, the most important thing is fire steel. And knife. What else is here? What's that? There's a lighter, there's fire starters that are toothpicks yeah. and stuff from the Matisse. Yeah, basically, it's good. Maybe a little bit of string, mm. fishing line. Do you have any on no, you? Not on me. Oh, I'm mm. dead. I'm gonna have to make some out in the jungle. Maybe out of chambira or something like that. All right. Well, I guess I'm ready. I'll yeah. see you guys in two days. Thank you, Gordon. Okay. As you were. Sorry to wake you up. Are you having fun? <laughs> yeah, I have two, three. <laughs> <laughs> he was hiding. <laughs> All right. So then. Out of all this, we're going to go to my camp and um, I'm going to go try and get a fire started at least with this stuff and, and try and remain dry. Maybe underneath my bushcraft table or something. I love it. <laughs> Here we go. So Joe, tell me why would somebody even need a kit like this? Yeah. Um, so like we're out in the jungle and yeah, having string is important in the jungle, but even like in our daily lives, being prepared is really important. For instance, one time I had string in my pocket, got into a uh, small accident um and uh wanted to drive home but uh 
That was Cameron. I'm sorry. Yeah, you were saying no, something great. important. So uh, <laughs> the ability to, to improvise is really important. And for instance, I might have string in my pocket here, but also like if I'm in the city and I get into a fender bender and I want to drive home and I don't want that fender, you know, dragging on the ground, that string's important just to tie up my fender or things along that line where you need a lighter um, just to fray up some loose ends on your backpack that you might have because your backpack's really old. So it's important to be prepared for that and to know what you need internally and how to use it. So not just because you have the knife, but knowing how to use it's, you know, kind of important. Love it. Bring that burrito. Alrighty, let's go. Man, this burrito is actually pretty awesome for... Uh, Thanks. It's, it's probably a little small for like hardcore bushcraft, but like... Oh, for here, I think it's perfect though. Yeah, because um, I've already envisioned, okay, I could put an awl in here for like hardcore bushcrafting and all one of those whittling jacks, you know, the ones that are like about a hundred bucks. Um, a strop, like the ones, mm -hmm. a lot of just stuff that would be adding on to your um, kit. And there you have it, guys. Joe? Awesome. Thank you, sir. This is always fun to me. Just going out and doing interesting stuff like this where it's like, what ifs, you know? You play that game of like, would this work, would it not? If you like the Tool Burrito, you can buy it anywhere NAFS products are sold. It is the NAFS Tool Burrito. And we have a lot of fun with it, especially with our man out in the bush joe flowers bush arito thanks guys hit that subscribe button and uh especially because now we have none other than dan eastland with his shirt off <laughs> subscribe for dan subscribe for more <laughs> it's all good excuse me is the gym over that way <laughs> or is it <laughs> over there <laughs> there it is guys thanks for watching